opinion alongside me will be Jim Beglin. Hi Peter, always good to work with you. I'm really looking forward to this now. So Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? Yeah, Zlatan Ibrahimovic. And I'm sure he'll appreciate the attention, Peter. A huge physical presence, Peter, in that front line, but with an eye for the spectacular and the barely believable at times, such as his gift for improvisation. He can pull off tricks that no other players can even dream about. Yes, he's certainly the one who carries the hopes of his team. Hernandez tries to get it forward quickly. Well, that's where he wants it. Well positioned to make that interception. Pumps it upfield. That's good defence, uh, plain and simple, good defence. They refuse to allow a turn. And that had to be more accurate. One Bissaka, aimed long and direct. Back to the keeper and go again. Hernandez, who's going to make this theirs? De Gea gets it upfield. Oh, good interception. Goes direct to the front line. One Bissaka, spoon forward. Rashford showed plenty of zest in getting to the ball, but couldn't quite sort it out. Pogba pumps it upfield. Cavani crosses into the box. Kia. Samu Castillejo. Now it's Ibrahimovic. Hernandez. It over to the other flank. Oh, that's not going to find its target. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? Whipped it again. Goal! Milan! And Milan have the lead. Oh, high quality goal. Lovely first touch. Sumptuous second. Whistle goes for half time. Well, they definitely won't be happy with that half. They seem to lack a bit of desire, especially going forward. It wouldn't surprise me to see a change or two. So off we go once more. Manchester United need to get the balance right to sort this out. Ambition must be complemented by. Just the right amount of caution, and I think the more experienced players can oversee that. Coaxed out to the wing. Swept in. He's going to have to tune his rangefinder before the next one. And it's Martial. It's a good-looking cross. Bonaventura gets it back. Looks to thread it through. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. It's a long forward pass. Tries to dink it in. Up for a header! Great build-up. It all deserved a better ending. Oh, such a good ball to get him through. Showed real vision and awareness then in trying to pick him out. It's got through to him. It's a loose ball. 
Out wide to the right. Alex Tellez does well there. Alert. Looks to bypass the midfield. Ambitious to say the least. He seemed to be in a hurry to get that in. Milan have made it clear what they're trying to do for me, Peter. What are they trying to do? Well, I think they're making the pitch as big as possible to work both flanks into, into better supply routes. Chances keep on coming, they're awarded another corner. Fence has got rid of that. Great strike, but the keeper's equal to it. Pogba crosses one in. Dinks one in. Oh, he'll be annoyed at himself for not getting there. Boraventura set up one goal so far. Aimed long and direct. It's a long ball, but it's not hit its target. This defence just doesn't trust itself to, to play a higher line. Frighten the people getting in behind. Yeah, absolutely. It just opens up the opportunity of not only strikers getting behind, but the runners from midfield too. Lindelof cuts it out. That's the route one option. Chalanolu. Brahim Diaz. Maguire positions himself well and cuts it out. Done very well to intervene. Boraventura tries to get it forward quickly. Who's going to make this theirs? Rashford. Fired in from distance. Added time is up and there goes the whistle. Always in the balance and in the end one goal was enough. They are narrowly beaten. Listen, they had plenty of time to overcome the setback, but for me, they never quite had enough adventure in their play to get back into that one.